I'm here with an update on leprosy in Myanmar. It is a tough situation, but there are also hope. Our organization, the Leprosy Mission Myanmar, is the only one still providing leprosy services despite everything that's been happening since the military took over in February 2021. We are grateful we can run mobile clinics, staffed by former leprosy specialists to reach out to those who can't travel because of their fear of buzzing checkpoints. Thankfully, a clinic in Yangon is also up and running, receiving around 10% of new leprosy cases. On the advocacy front, the Myanmar Association of Persons Affected by Leprosy, Maple is doing fantastic work as they speak up for themselves above all their time and money limitations. But TLM Myanmar does not have a lot of money to support them properly. We are blessed to have staff who can skillfully provide prosthetic and advocating for disability inclusion. This is vital with so many people are hurting during the conflict. We give thanks that we are also seeing a growing interest to leprosy among our partners. Now, the challenges. Many leprosy services have stopped and people are struggling to get the care they need. There are also reports of more leprosy cases. The conflict has worsened the situation by hurting the economy and making people more vulnerable. Please pray for people affected by leprosy to find help, for our mobile clinics to reach those in need, for our partners to get more involved, and for the safety of our staff, especially the younger ones who might get conscripted. We also urgently need funding to keep fighting leprosy so Myanmar can keep moving towards getting rid of leprosy for good. Thank you very much. We are dealing with a big challenge of funding gap for year 2024. It was not easy to accept uh, the hope uh, in the midst of the very difficult situations and being the head of operations and finance, I can predict the coming consequences um, because of the big funding gap. As mentioned in Hebrew chapter 12 verse 2, let us keep our eyes fixed on Jesus, on whom our faith depends from beginning to end. So with the hope of this, uh, we worked and we prayed and we are very grateful with our God uh, as we have begun to see uh, the necessary funding uh, provisions for the leprosy work for 2024. We want to thank God for the blessing that we has received at the Sound Leopard in our last day for the good help and high spirit of the team members. We kindly ask for prayers to help us with our project work in Timor, especially in rural areas. We are also preparing to launch a new project in Rayo municipality to end the leprosy transmission. Please pray for a successful installation process and the well-being of our team. We also ask for prayers for our team members who are working hard on every program. Lord, we thank you for your faithfulness this time. Lord, we thank you for the faithfulness that you have shown to a founding father and which is flowing till today and in all the generations to come. Lord, we thank you for the great vision translated into practical acts that lives are enriched and transformed. Lord, we thank you for the redeeming love of Christ that flows through the compassionate acts of the staff and many people are relieved from their ailments. Lord, we thank you that in all the days to come, you are going to fulfill all the needs that the work of the leprosy mission will continue, Lord, till no one is left behind. We thank you for your son, Jesus Christ, who initiated the healing ministry on earth. We also thank you for the Leprosy Mission Trust India, for the hospitals, VTCs and projects. Thank you for our staffs who are involved in this ministry, their vision, commitment and their hard work. The resources you continue to provide us through our supporting countries and world visas. We also thank you for the Holy Spirit that gives us the power, wisdom and strength to do our work and face challenges. 
and commit our plans, strategies and activities into your hands. Even in challenging times, help us achieve zero leprosy. And that you will walk with us, be beside us and be the source of everything that we need. Especially pray that you raise a generation of leaders and people who will carry on this vision of the leprosy mission. Father God, we commit ourselves to stand in humble prayer. We thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness through this long journey of 150 years of leprosy mission. We thank you, Lord, for bringing in your chosen people for leadership and serving your purpose. Father God, we thank you for our supporters and friends worldwide who work as a team. Especially, we bring before your throne our patients are. Touch them and bless them with your healing hands. Praying in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen.